<laughs> 630 on this Thursday. Our top local story this half hour. Sentencing day for a man charged with robbing a Bozeman vape shop and firing a weapon at a store employee. MTN's Cody Boyer went back to where it all happened and has the latest. I was just surprised it happened here, honestly. Surveillance footage still holds a lasting memory for Mellow Mood employees Mike Wimsat and Journey McKay. He went over the went over the counter and pushed him down, and that's when the kid on the ground was like pulling out a gun. Chase just leaped over the counter and just took after him, and just like it was scary though, yeah. especially because there was people practicing band over there, like on the MSU fields. Matthew Norlander, driven to the store by Michael St. Pierre, walked inside, acting as if he we're going to buy the $400 water pipe before making the dash. Wimsad and McKay say their co-worker Chase was hot on his heels. Cameras caught every move. I was really surprised. I actually knew the guy. So that was just kind of like, I, it was bound to happen eventually. Someone could have gotten hurt. This is our little store. Mm -hmm. Like not very many people come in that we like are sketched out about, but, and they acted totally normal. On top of Norlander's seven years, the Bozeman man will also spend the following five in probation. McKay says it's a punishment she's been waiting to hear. I thought it was fair. Like, I mean, he has to pay for what he did and he is. And that's good, you know, it's a full circle. I'm just glad that's not going to happen again, it seems, at least hopefully for a while. In Bozeman, Cody Boyer, MTN News. Cody tells us court documents show Norlander had a six-year deferred sentence for several counts of burglary in the past, which is why the Justice Court judge set his bail at over half a million dollars.